Good evening and welcome to St. Luke's Anglican Church in Oakville for Saturday, July the 25th. I'm the Reverend Jody Belint and with me this evening is our pianist Janet Correa. Thank you for joining us for our Compline service this evening. Let us still our hearts and have a moment of silence as we prepare for our service. Let us pray. The angels of God guard us through the night and quiet the powers of darkness. The Spirit of God be our guide and lead us to peace and glory. But it is about lost labor that we hesitate to rise up early and so late to take rest and to eat the bread of anxiety. For those beloved of God are given gifts even while they sleep. Our help is in the name of the eternal God, who is making the heavens and the earth. Dear God, thank you for all that is good for our creation and our humanity, for the stewardship you have given us of this planet earth, for the gifts of life and of one another, for your love which is unbounded and eternal. O thou most holy and beloved, our companion, our guide, upon the way, our bright evening star. We repent for the wrongs we have done. We have wounded your love, O oh God, heal yes. us. We stumble in the dark. Light of the world, transfigure us. We forget that we are your home. Spirit of God, dwell in us. Eternal Spirit, flow through our being and open our lips that our mouths may proclaim your praise. Let us worship the God of love. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Let's read Psalm 16 together. O oh God, I give you thanks for the wisdom of your counsel. Even at night you have instructed my heart. I have set your face always before me. You are at my right hand, and I shall not fall. Therefore my heart is glad and my spirit rejoices. My flesh also shall rest secure. For you will not give me over to the power of death, nor let your faithful one see the pit. In your presence is the fullness of joy, and from your right hand flow delights forevermore. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be. Amen. A reading from the Gospel of Luke, chapter 6, verses 27 to 38. Love your enemies. Do good to those who hate you. Bless those who curse you. Pray for those who abuse you. Do good and lend, expecting nothing in return. For God is kind to the ungrateful and the selfish. Be merciful as your Father is merciful. Judge not, and you will not be judged. Condemn not, and you will not be condemned. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. Give, and it will be given to you. For the measure you give will be the measure you receive. Let us pray. Into your hands, O God, I commend my spirit. 
For you have redeemed me, O God, of truth and love. Keep me, O God, as the apple of your eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. Preserve us, O God, while we are awake, and guard us while we are asleep, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in your spirit. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of everyone, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people, Israel. Preserve us, O God, while we are awake, and guard us while we are asleep, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in your peace. Lord, have mercy. Christ, Christ have, have mercy. mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, it is night, and the night is for stillness. May we be still in the presence of God. It is night after a long day. What has been done has been done. What has not been done has not been done. I leave it in your loving hands. The day, the night is dark. Let our fears of the darkness of the world and of our own lives rest in you. The night is quiet. Let the quietness of your peace enfold us all dear to us and all who have no peace. The night heralds the dawn. Let us look expectantly to a new day, new joys and new possibilities. In your name we pray, amen. Instead of the Lord's Prayer, we're saying an alternative prayer, which comes from the New Zealand Prayer Book. If you would like, please join me. Eternal Spirit, Earth Maker, Pain Bearer, Life Giver, Source of all that is and that shall be, Father, Mother of us all, Loving God, in whom is heaven, the hallowing of your name echo through the universe, the way of your justice to be followed by the peoples of the world. Your heavenly will be done by all created beings, your commonwealth of peace and freedom shall sustain our hope and come on earth. With the bread we need for this day, feed us. In the hurts we absorb from one another, forgive us. In the times of temptation and test, strengthen us. From the trials too great to endure, spare us. From the grips of all that is evil, free us. For you reign in the glory of the power that is love, now and forever. Amen. I will lie down in peace and take my rest, for it is in God alone that I dwell unafraid. Let us bless the earth maker, the pain bearer, and the life giver. Let us praise and exalt God above all forever. May God's name be praised above, beyond the furthest star, glorified and exalted above forever. Eternal Spirit, living God, in whom we live and move and have our being, all that we are and have been and shall be known to, sh shall be is known to you, to the very secrets of our hearts. Living flame, burn in us, cleansing wind, blow through us, that we may love and praise you in deed and in truth. Amen. Christ, be within us to keep, beside us to guard, before us to lead, behind us to protect, beneath us to support, and above us to bless. Amen. The Divine Spirit lives in us. Hallelujah. Thanks be to God. Hallelujah.